Welcome to No Ordinary Path. Today is not an ordinary episode. We're doing a very short little blip just to let you guys know that we've made it to Reno. We're here. We made it safely. We had a whirlwind of a week. First of all, a thank you. Thank you so much to all of those of you who have been with us so far on this journey. We have been all, all over. Our kids have had their toes in both oceans. It's just been, it's been pretty amazing. We know that you look forward to episodes every week and we don't want to miss an episode this week, but you know, life happens. We, when we travel, we drive with two vehicles. We have John in the truck with a kid and a dog. And then I follow in the van with the other two kids. So I don't ever have any downtime when we are traveling in between contracts to actually get editing done. This week, this last week, we have driven from Phoenix here to Reno. While that's a really long drive, if you do it in one shot, we broke it up so that we could see some really neat things along the way. While we didn't get to stop in Sedona, we did drive through it and it was gorgeous. Halfway between Sedona and Flagstaff, we got up into the trees and where the snow was and it was just beautiful. We have done some amazing stuff. We actually got to visit the Grand Canyon, which is one of the things that was definitely on Kristen's bucket list, has never seen it. Now, that being said, we're definitely gonna have to go back because it was just not enough. From Grand Canyon, we went on toward Las Vegas and we stopped at the Hoover Dam, which was an awesome experience, albeit very cold and a little scary with children who wanted to look over the edge. <laughs> we ended up driving to Las Vegas where we had our own little adventure as we were kind of coming through, the weather started coming in and got a pretty significant snowstorm we were going to try to push through and drive to Death Valley National Park, but just couldn't. They started closing the roads and passes. Chain laws uh, were in effect on the highway. We woke up to about six inches of snow on our van and then we headed on to Death Valley. We weren't sure what we were going to find there, but it was so cool. Death Valley was amazing. Just like every other national park we visit, oh, I wish we had more time to be there and check it out. Then from there, we went and um, stayed in Tonopah, Nevada, which is this little small podunk town up in the mountains. But we went that direction because there is a really cool solar operation there. And then we headed towards Reno. We stayed overnight in Silver Springs and then finally arrived in Reno on Saturday where we had to get Wendy all hooked up and we all got showers. It was amazing. And uh, so now we are we're getting settled in and we have so much stuff to do. Two weeks worth of laundry to get done and all the things get settled in all the ways. So we're going to take a week off and we're going to come back next week with a fresh video on our Southwest wrap up. And then the following week we'll, t we'll give you all the details of this travel week we did on the way to Reno. Hope that sounds good. Thanks for staying with us. Have a wonderful, wonderful Sunday night. Stay tuned for Tuesday for John's hospital review of Banner Del Webb. Hey boys, don't throw snowballs at your sister. Real life. <laughs>